watching This Is 50.com with your man, the man, this nigga, Jack Twiller. Check him out, y'all. This is Jack Twiller. Hey, what's happening? Yeah. Fresh out that oven, fresh, fresh out that oven. Busting down doors, busting down tours. You were still in Walmart, busting down floors. Need help? I can show you how to bust down yours. Been around the world. Man, dog, I'm glad to have you here today, man. You've been got, you got a lot of things popping off, man. You know what I'm saying? You was on the, you know, the, the in studio booth yeah. with G Unit and whatnot, that mixtape. Yeah. And yes, then, sir. you know, yes, sir. Yes, sir. you did the digital, digital mixtape. Yeah, with the Tommy Boy. The yeah, 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 man. That. So, what's the move right now? Um, we right here, man. I'm in, I'm in the G unit building, so I'm doing something right, right? You're right. You're always doing something right, dog. You're doing, you're doing something right. Now, everybody can't get here. This is everybody can't get here. Look, man, I might get some haters after that, man. Yeah, most definitely, man. Your Vivo numbers is ridiculous. Online presence is there. You're doing all the right things right now, dog. Died in Paris. Can't forget about Toronto, yo. Fresh out that oven. Chasing my... Nah, Amir, man, um... I don't know, man. I, I call myself the architect or the engineer of this fly nigga hardcore music. You understand mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like, a lot of the shit that I make, you know, I like to call it fly nigga hardcore. And not an ignorant when I say the word nigga. Because I'm going to get offended, but I can get two shits because nobody's going to happen to hell for me. Right. But at the end of the day, the music itself is a complete, like, it's a complete sonic to me. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? As far as if you're going to take, if you're going to take, the Beatles, Motown, and modern day hip hop and try to combine it and give it a sound or give it a the soundtrack to what the lives that we live in now. I like to I like to call it flying nigga hardcore, but I also like to call it world hop to the degree where I feel like if anybody from any hood around the world, you know what I'm saying, it's, mm -hmm. it's hip hop to the death. Mm -hmm. But if you gotta put your own twist on it, like you said to describe it, what, we, what we've made over the years, man, is, I would have to definitely call it the kind of the heart. Place all bets so we could gamble on the two track. Pay my debts, credit good, thought you knew that. Sniff the aroma, success smells sweet, don't it? I got the pedal to the metal, both feet on So Amir, man, what's one of the biggest uh, misconceptions about you? The biggest, I think, misconception about me, man, is that <clears throat> that I would have to say that, that, that some people may say the kid come off kind of arrogant or mm -hmm. whatever, and that's more or less because of the way you may possibly look. You understand? It has nothing to really do with your personality, you know what I'm saying? So for me, I think that's a big misconception, and the misconception is that people think you own when you're really not. Mm -hmm. I'm not, and I don't even have anywhere in my mind that I think that I'm on or I'm in. Mm -hmm. I will never, and even when I'm in, I'm still going to be looking at somebody who has more, like, why? Wow. You know what I'm saying? I need to be there too. So the biggest misconception about me is I think that people may feel like that something was also given to me easy. Mm -hmm. And nothing was given to me easy. We worked hard for this shit, man. We wasn't getting no sleep. I'm telling you, you're not getting much sleep out here. Hey, man, and that's what it takes, dog. It definitely it's, does, man. If you wouldn't rap, what would you be doing? Because you got a big background. Honestly, man, I... I I honestly don't know. I mean, and I, that's not a, I don't that's not a dumbass answer. I mean, I'm gonna give an honest answer. I really don't know. I want, I don't want to think about what I want to be doing. Dave was telling me, man, this is how life goes sometimes. Dancing to these songs, even though you know they faking. It's only for the moment. It's only entertainment. I cried alone in pursuit of my happiness. Tears burned through the effing pillow and the mattresses. Um, I'm here, man. You Talk know what I'm saying? Um, dude, let's get into the, uh, your, your situation with Russell Simmons, man. Tell us about that. I have a clean Africa event is in a couple of hours, and I'm downtown at Russell's penthouse apartment. I used to have quarter water dreams, now with your rolls of dollars. Bury those Timberlands, walk on Prada's. Called Welcome to the Game. You know, shouts out to Justine and my man Shot Bugs. Um, and it ended up on his TV show, mm -hmm. Running Russell. Mm -hmm. um, we first heard the record, we really didn't know how it got out there, but then we came to come to find out that Justine had finagled something. She hustled him. Mm -hmm. and, and, you know, it got picked as one of the records. And, um, he was offered a mixtape I did called Going Till February. Listen up, y'all. Honestly. Look in my eyes, man. Honestly. My life crazy, man. Success, Jay ain't lie. Cause I done burned down the blocks and everything that's fly. I'm like Barack Obama with beads on, but I'm complex. I never claim to be king of, but I'm prince. I look local, but so far am I transporting. Navigating through dark corners while breaking dawning. The cell's low, but the bell's high speed balling. And my connects and my connects, man, I'm done talking. I got plans for the black McLaren. Only shooting at me close range, man, will be Paris. You paralyzed by love while I flirt with power. Taking sips of light through a straw by the hour. I'm so next day air. I next day swear you could cry me a river. I don't next day care. 
I cooked a full course meal out of Hell's Kitchen. 99% of these rappers are Pulp Fiction. That's no BS like it's no TS, and that's no distant fat joke, but put that in PS. A man, 25th hour man. Yeah, it is right there, man. You gotta give me some on that, though. <laughs> Nigga, you cold as ice, baby. You cold as ice, Charlie Murphy. <laughs> Charlie Murphy. <laughs> Fuck your couch, nigga. It's a celebration, bitches. Hey, man, like I always say, you just can't say you're real or something. You gotta be over here with my man, Amir, man. I'm signing off now, for real. <laughs>